Daily Stoic. It's Thursday morning. Uh, there was a wildfire, so the weather was really bad, but it seems getting better now. Hopefully I can finish today and then back home. We see. July 25th. What's on your tombstone? When you see someone often flashing their rank or position, or someone whose name is often bandied about in public, do not be envious. Such things are bought at the expense of life. Some die on the first rungs of the ladder of success. Others, before they can reach the top, and the few that make it to the top of their ambition through a thousand indignities realize at the end it's only for an inscription on their gravestone. Seneca on the bravery of life 20. Sometimes Sometimes our professional commitment can become an end unto themselves. A politician might justify the neglect of his family for his office, or a writer might believe his her genius excuses antisocial or selfish behavior. Anyone with some perspective can see that. In fact, the politician is really just in love with fame. And the writer enjoys being condescending and super feeling superior. Workaholics always make excuses for their selfishness. While these attitudes can lead to impressive accomplishments, yes, their cost is rarely justified. The ability to work hard and long is admirable, but you are a human being, not human doing. Seneca points out that we are not animals. Is it really so pleasant to die in harness. He asked. Alexander Solzhenitsyn put it better. Work is what horses die of. Everybody should know that. So it's again. So your title your position, your fame, your superiority, all the thing. You'd be happy if that thing is written in the new gravestone and tombstone and then that's it. That's all about it. You been running for your entire life so far till the end to have that inscription on your tombstone. Or you're thinking about something else not sure but as you know almost every single person on earth historically at the end of their life there are always something they regret and there are always something that they said I should have I could have well if the work the fame the position the rank whatever it is called if something causes you to say, I regret, then maybe it's not too late to rethink about what you're into for your life. Thank you. Have a great rest of the Thursday. Hopefully, see you tomorrow.